Hello, today we're going to talk about handheld VHF. There are so many different VHF radios out on the market these days that uh, it can be quite a daunting prospect trying to find the right radio for you. Today we're going to look at our top five best sellers. We have units from Icon, Standard Horizon and Cobra. And we're going to try and pull out some of the features to help you decide which radio might be right for you. First radio we're going to look at today is the ICOM ICM25 Euro. It's a very light radio, it's only 220 grams. It's slimline, it feels good in the hand and it feels robust. It's available in blue and it's the flashes down the outside of, of the radio or grey. So let's just walk through the physical aspects of the M25. You have a detachable antenna. You have a waterproof uh, jack here for a fist mic. You have a belt clip which comes with the unit. The battery is inside the unit, sealed inside the unit behind this cover. On the bottom, you can't see it very well, but there's a transparent section where there's a it has is a red LED light behind there. When the unit's dropped in the, if the unit's dropped in the water, this will flash and be able to be seen through this transparent section. On the side, there's a door, and that is a waterproof door that uh, houses a USB slot there, a micro USB slot for charging the unit. On the front, we have our up and down arrows for going up and down the channel set channel 16 button, press and hold that to go to a channel of your choice that you program in. You have your volume and squelch button, so you press to toggle between volume and squelch and you use the up and down arrows to set those levels. You have a um, scan button, this unit has uh, priority scan, normal scan, and also dual watch and tri watch. A favorite button for your favorites to be incorporated into the scan um, and then you've got a high and low button which will change the power between one and five watts and when you're in low power mode it's indicated on the screen it's also a key lock function you press and hold this button for key lock the m25 has a decent sized display um, nice big digits to show the channel number you also have the battery status you have the volume levels you have your channel group, i.e. international USA or Canadian channel sets. Um, you have your low power mode. When you're in low power mode, that comes up on the display. So it's a nice, easy to read display. Features of the M25 are it's a five watt radio. So it's uh, got a transmission power of five watts. It floats. It flashes when floats. So not only does the LED screen flash, the... Um, LCD screen flashes as well. Um, the battery inside the unit is a 1500 milliamp hour battery, which gives you typically around 11 hours of usage and will take three hours to charge from flat. Uh, built into this radio, there are the UK Marina channels, M1 and M2. It has Aqua Quake for buzzing out water out of the speaker grill, it emits a loud, low frequency noise which expels any water in the speaker grill. Um, the unit can be programmed for ATIS, for European inland waterways. Um, waterproof to IPX7, so that is submersible down to one meter for up to 30 minutes. And the unit has a warranty of three years. So the M25 is shipped with the mains charger, the USB cable, a lanyard, and a comprehensive user manual. Tips for the M25 are make sure the USB door is fully shut before using the radio. Um, if this is open or partially open, then water could possibly get inside there. Second of all, the UK Marina channels, M1 is programmed as 37A and M2 is programmed as P4. 
Who should consider buying the ICOM M25? Well, anyone who's after a USB charging, lightweight, stylish radio that's easy to use, backed up with ICOM's three-year warranty.